First on Newspoint, a car thief steals a piece of family history on the Near East Side in broad daylight. Now the longtime owners are begging for help getting this back. Fox 59's Mike Sullivan spoke with police about this theft and joins us now to explain what makes it so unique. IMPD says vehicle thefts are often a crime of opportunity. For example, if a car is left unlocked or still running. In this case, a thief spent roughly 10 minutes loading the car onto a trailer. When you lose something, it's frustrating. It's unwelcoming. I want to find it. Like, I very much want to find it. For Madeline Hutchins, this vacant space on North Highland has created a void in her family, particularly the vehicle that used to occupy it. The truck is my husband's grandfather. He's still alive. He's 99. He lives in Huntsville, Alabama. For 35 years and just 56,000 miles, this 1987. Ford F-150 has been passed down generation after generation. In Huntsville, he had a watermelon farm, so he drove it to and from his watermelon farm. Up until two weeks ago, it had been parked in front of their home in Indy. It was very unfortunate when I came home to find it gone. Surveillance video capturing a thief loading it onto a trailer, making off with their piece of Hutchins history. I had to stop watching it <laughs> because the feelings I were feeling were very unhealthy. Police reports showed there have been at least six vehicle thefts within 10 blocks of hers. That's just since the start of April. It didn't seem like a regular theft of a car. It seemed like somebody had been watching it, paying attention to when we weren't home. Hutchins says her neighbor's Jeep was recently stolen on a trailer. So far, IMPD has yet to make any connection to these incidents. Those are our investigators, they may see where we've had multiple break-ins or multiple auto thefts in one area, that's always an alert to possibly that being a, a one suspect. Police suggest homeowners. Park in a well-lit area, parking in their garage if you have one accessible. Also, let officers know if your stolen car has any distinct markings. There are stickers on the back windshield. There's a Blackhawk sticker, an Auburn uh, University sticker. Every little piece of info may lead to a reunion. If you live in the area of North Highland and East St. Clair, please check your surveillance cameras. You may have got a closer look at the thief's vehicle. If you do see anything in your video or have any information, you are urged to contact police. In the newsroom, I'm Mike Sullivan, Fox 59 News.